Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. First video of 2021. So I hope everybody had a great new year and happy new year. Okay, so what we're going to do today is we're going to take a look at uh, mixed license plate receiving. So what this allows you to do is to have one license plate, but actually have multiple items received against that single license plate, right? So in normal uh, purchase receiving, when you're receiving, every time you're scanning, that's generating a license plate for the for the item, and then you go you go put it away. With uh, mixed license plate receiving, you initially tell it what license plates you want to receive against, uh, and then you receive all your merchandise against that license plate, and then it generates put away work. So you might use this for something like maybe you're put stacking items onto a cart or a pallet as you're receiving them, and you want to put them away. This would be, be a good way to uh, do that. Okay, so without further ado, let's go ahead and hop right in. Uh, what we're going to do is let's go into um, the mobile device menu setup is where all of this is done. So we're going to go into mobile device menu items. And I've created one here for us, which is mixed LP. And so pretty standard setup on this. We're just giving it a name and a title. The mode is going to be work. This is going to generate work for us. So we've got the use existing work set to know. And the work creation process is mixed license plate receiving. And then the source document is going to be purchase order. You've got kind of your standard uh, normal operations here. You can do purchase orders or loads, you know, st standard stuff. Now, one thing I'll mention to you is that there is no option on this to generate a license plate. So if you're if you're needing to generate a license plate, there's really there's not the option on this menu item. I'm not sure exactly why this particular option doesn't have a generate license plate. I'm sure there's a reason, but um, this one does not. So you either need to have a license plate affixed to something like a car or pallet or have a roll of pre-printed license plates. Uh, that you could stick on something that you could use for the license plate. Okay, so what I've done is I've created a purchase order for us of A001 and A002 uh, for 8 and 10. I've gone and created this and I've, I've actually confirmed it here. Okay, so if we flip over to the mobile device, I've got a menu item here, mixed, mixed LP receiving. So again, the first thing it's going to ask me is for a license plate. So let's just go and call it Scott 100. For our license plate, we're going to say OK. And the next thing it's going to do is going to ask us for a PO number. So I'll flip back over here and grab the purchase order number. Copy that. And then that way I can paste it in here. Paste the PO number in there. Then it's going to ask us for the item. So we'll put in our A001. And for this example, let's, let's go ahead. The quantity we ordered of this was eight. I'm going to go ahead and put five for, I'll show you why here in a minute. And we'll go ahead and say OK to that. And then we'll go ahead and receive all of our A002. So let's click on here, A002. And we ordered 10, so I'm going to go ahead and receive 10. And then we'll say OK. Now this one's got kind of a special, some special uh, features on it. So we can actually see a list of the items that are on this uh, license plate now that we've, we've generated. So how we do that is if we go up here to the hamburger menu here, we'll click on that and we'll click on show list and it'll show us every item that's that's on our um, on our license plate okay so notice here we received five out of eight so let's say I want to change that um, this actually lets you change it as well so if we click up from here click on the hamburger menu here we go to modify and we tell it what line we want to modify I want to modify line one go ahead and say okay and then we're gonna put in the new quantity so let's go ahead and make that match up we're gonna go ahead and put eight in there and say that okay now at this point what you need to do is you've, you've generated your license plate you've gotten everything you know set up on your license plate so what we're going to do is we're going to basically complete this license plate all right so the way we do that is we're going to go up here to the menu and then we're going to go license plate complete now before i do that i just want to point out that you can change the po number so if you've got another po number that you want to receive some more merchandise against you can change the po number receive some more items against it and then, then do your license plate complete. Okay, so you can add additional POs on it. So let's go ahead and do the LP complete. And it's gonna show us our list again of, of the items that are on our license plate. We're just gonna hit okay. And that will uh, receive in our license plate. 
Okay, now as far as the put away, exact same thing. Let's go ahead and hit cancel there and let's flip out here. We'll go ahead and take a look at the work that was created. So let's go back down into warehouse management and we're going to go into all work. And then we should see some work that got generated here. We'll click on this one. And so you see that we, we're, it's the work, the put away work is take, telling us to take it from the receiving location and we're putting away a 0001 and then we're going to put away a 0002. Okay. So let's go ahead and do that. And then, sorry, I should have pointed out my license plate here is, is Scott 100. So there's, there's the license plate that got generated. So received items put away. It's normal put away uh, menu item that we, we normally use here. So we're just going to go to receive put away. And we could either scan a work ID or a license plate. I'll click on that. And we'll put Scott uh, 100 in there for the license plate. Go ahead and hit OK. And it's telling us to pick up multiple items for this target license plate. We'll go ahead and say OK to that. And then so on this one, I've got uh, location confirmation set up. So I'm going to put in FL-001. That'll be the first location once it's put away. And this location requires a license plate. So I'm going to put Scott uh, one for the put away license plate. And then location two for 10. Here's our A002. So I'm going to confirm that location FL-02. And then it's just going to use the license plate that we've already generated there. Okay. So this is pretty handy if you're going to receive different merchandise to the same license plate and then you want to go put it away. Uh, again, the best example I can think of is maybe a cart or a pallet and you're going to go put, put the stuff away and you want the, them to go in a certain order there. So it seems like the most logical use for this. Okay, so I hope you found some value in this. If you did, please like the video or give it a thumbs up. That just helps me out on the distribution of the video, helps more people see it. Um, just if you, if you don't mind just liking it. And also, um, Feel free to subscribe and, and hit the notification bell if you want to get notified when I update a new upload a new video. I put out one of these about once a week. Um, last year I did pretty good. About once a week I put put one out. Uh, plan on continuing to do that again this year. So please go ahead and subscribe and hit the notification bell. Again, that's going to help me with the distribution as well. Okay. So again, happy new year, happy 2021. Um, until next time. Thanks for watching. See you later. Bye.